Hello everybody and welcome back. We do have a huge problem. Now, first of all, we do have, well, Breisgau and or Freiburg as well now here, which is pretty cool. And we're growing, that is nice and all. But what we have is we have no alliances anymore except Foggia. Foggia, as we can see, is down here in Italy and extremely weak themselves. I wouldn't be surprised if they kind of die soon, sooner or later now. He's a spineless villain there, so no one really likes him. So he's not trustworthy at all. Why did I lose my alliances? Because both my wives lost their husbands. Both of them are dead. Look at this guy here. He was old, okay? He was old. But still, he is um, gone from us. So she's now, I think at least, back in our court. That's right. And that means that, well, we do need to find new husbands for them. She's in prison. There is the question what we do with her. Do we let her rot there? Um, ransoming her, though, costs me a hundred. Right? So this is not something that I'm willing to do right now. She's 30 as well, so not that good anymore. Rachel, on the other hand, she is still fine. Um, we could invite, invite her to a court. Or we suggest a marriage between her and someone else. Or, actually... Yeah, she's not, my, I mean, she's my daughter, but she's now in another court. We could um, invite her to our court, and then she would be our court here once again. Do we have a hook? No, actually, she will accept anyway, because she, you know, um, yeah, she lost her husband there. In that case, she's lost anyway. Um, we got still, I think, two sons there. Let's have a look what we could do alliance power-wise. Oh, we could have the King of England. That is something I'm actually going with. And she's intelligent as well. This is congenital. This is a must, to be honest. Um, we could, uh, He would get 200 prestige out of this one. And alliance with the King of Wessex. Now, that is extremely powerful. That is something we're going with. Um, and then we still need something else. My other son. We would have... What is that? Balaton, Slovenian over there. Sounds good to me. We would have also French, but they're much weaker. Yeah, this is also intelligent trade. Interesting, right? So I got some very uh, intelligent wives there now for my sons. This would give me new alliances. And we have the alliance now with Balaton. And we have the alliance now with Ethel Wolfston of Wessex, who is calling us to war right away. I'm going to decline on this one. But we got now the King of Wessex there. That is pretty cool. So we are powerful right so when i go with one of these pals here they should be no problem for us <laughs> that is something that i like so we might use this momentum that we have because we can call him to the war um that we take us something new in that case what i can see here this one the county of grinningen we do have the same leech for that she's his ally to brabant and she's allied to Hohenberg. Both of them are not that strong. Right, so we might actually go with this Fürstenberg and Grinningen, which is just above here, going to Germany. Um, on the other hand, we would have also um, Alsace here, so we could still go with that, you know, having then Strasbourg and here Mulhouse for us. That might also be something, I, I think she's weaker. Same leech, 550 military strength, no alliances. We might actually make a title here. Yeah, let's claim this one. Let's fabricate a claim for um, Sundau, Sundgau, which is this one here, right? So we get something new. So we're kind of like going into France there, more or less. But perhaps something interesting happens with Bavaria at some point. No idea. At the moment, we have a queen here. She's got no children. She's pretty weak overall. Um, she's allied, though, to Friaul once again. Um... Who knows what happens out of this one. We got a new perk. Um, mortal Adoration. Your lovers are less likely to join murder schemes. Seduction scheme power. This goes down to the whole seduction thing. Yeah. Or we go with Dark Insights or Dread. Dread gain 30%. Let's do with this. We're dreadful. Makes us less likely from our allies that re rebel for us. And look at that. All my vassals like me. All my children like me. Basically, everyone likes me right now. Um, pass limit, crown authority. This is not possible at the moment because we're still selling culture. Um, and we do not have the plenary assemblies yet. Let's just have a look at our culture anyway. So selling culture that we have here. Um, as we can see, we are in the trial age more or less. Um, there's still more, two more tags that are missing before we can, well, go up there. And in that case, who is the leader right now? 
Conrad of Savoy. He is the, the current leader, the cultural leader. So he is at the moment researching the mods, which is quite quickly done soon. But he's very bad at learning. And then it, we would still need the Casus Belly. And those two shouldn't take that much longer anymore. 30 years. I hope he dies soon because he's really bad at it. Um, and then we can advance to the next age and this will give us then something in return. Benedict has been asking me for a pet rabbit for a long time. I told him I would get one for him in three months if he displayed more focus in his studies. He simply waved my offer away saying he did not really care about that anymore. And he gets or he keeps the trade fickle. Um, bit of stress there perhaps. Content and... Tr oh, trusting is never good. Diplomacy trick and content. Learning and minus intrigue. No, let's just say that way. And there we have it. Another claim, 40 coin. And we do have the claim now on Sundgau, which is just what I wanted. I'm also really eyeing this one here. Um, though that is strong, right? So here we have the child. This one here is through marriage. This alliance there. Perhaps we might murder her. Ah, the chance is not so bad. We would need to invite someone else into this whole thing. But other than that... How is my spy master looking? Supporting the schemes. Let's try it because if we succeed with this one, she would uh, the the son here would be the new heir, and he does not have an alliance, so this would make the whole thing here much easier. And if it fails, well then it fails. We already hate her. She already hates us. No harm done. And she is vastly inferior, as we can see, and that means only one thing, it is time for war once again. Though, when we look at that vastly inferior, it does um, count all, only, well, not only our army, but also the ones of our allies, of course. My army is way too weak at the moment, even though, yeah, it is. So let's find us a val an, an ally. We don't need Wessex for this, right? Um, Wessex calling to war, how much would this cost us? 150 prestige, so that is actually not that bad. But I think with Balaton, that's a thousand that we have there. I think he would come as well, right? He's n not at war with anyone at the moment. Cold War, 150 prestige, and he will then join me as well. And perhaps the smaller one that we have, Fodger. No, he's just way too weak. Right, let's raise my armies. Also a bit of, of, of soldiers that we have there. 358 coming out there. And of course, he is joining. There he is, a thousand soldiers coming now. And what we need to do is, first of all, I'm going away from her wrath. That is her first little army that's coming towards us now. And I don't want to lose my soldiers all the time. I think she's actually waiting there now. Experimentation. I offered Gerol Gerolamo my sincere thanks as he stares angrily at me through a haze of alchemy. It wasn't easy to find someone to volunteer <laughs> to volunteer to test my collection of substances. For him, it has been an evening of pain, burning sensation, occasional unconsciousness. This has been most insightful. We get a skin power of plus one. Alright, but he doesn't like us anymore. Alright, nice event there. My poor bishop. What I'm doing with him. All the things that I do. Written in stars. This is the murder scheme for the Countess Elizabeth to get rid of her alliances there. Um, in that case, she would get the bad omen. That is moderate penalty for her health and the murder scheme progresses. Very good. Where are we now? 53%. Can we invite someone? It would actually not be that expensive. They're also expensive. But of course, I'm a man of gamble there from time to time. So 53% chance it might, it might work. All right. My leech lost the war once again against someone against King Solvi of, oh, Sweden. Yes, we know Sweden from the Celtic throne already. They're pretty powerful. They become pretty powerful. And I certainly don't want to fight them. Also, my daughter. Nope, I'm not paying 100 coin for my daughter. That is too much. And I think we are actually getting caught now. My ally is coming there already. Right, she's really chasing me. But my ally, he will help me. Hopefully. There he is. Taking a bit of time there. 
Oh no, but we're getting we're caught up now in West Francia, the army that was also here because they have a war against my king and they came in from the south and destroyed my army thus. Alright, this is bad, but well, this army is also destroying her. That is at least something. Alright, solitude in the great hall. Clement seems to have been having a difficult time at our latest feast. He slipped underneath one of the tables and there hid from the people. What is what is it with my people? Shy, impatient, gives him at least a bit of prestige and a bit of stress there too. Uninvited, oh murder scheme, one of my agents has acquired a deadly spider. 53% huh, chance to kill her, let's try it. And this was not successful, of course not. I'm never lucky with those, with those things. 53% chance, of course it had to go wrong. But in that case, doesn't matter. We still are on the tracks there, defeating her. As we can see, my ally is doing the job for us anyway. I mean, we paid him a nice sum there for all of those things. West Frank here is actually laying siege to my county there once again. And we got a new skill. Um, thriving through chaos, martial per stress level. Oh, that's a good one. We have a high stress level, so we would be getting a lot of extra points there right now. Let's do this. Alright, gaining a few points there. 17 Intrigue, 16 Steward that we have right now. Oh, yeah. Alright, the her Heretics. Once again. Oh, more and more people are joining this Valdaniasism. This strange sect. Right, she's destroying the army once more. We are at 35%, so she still needs to lay siege there. Oh, she actually, my, my ally here. He still needs to lay siege to everything. Um, we lost a few wars there. We can declare something. You can call in allies. Um, Constantine needs a guardian. Doesn't have one yet. Let's just check that. We do have quite a lot. Oh, yeah. He's good. He's my student knight and he's got 17 stewardship. He's a fortune builder. This might be something. I like to have stewards there as my people there. Benedict comes of age. We do have... Right? They can marry now. Let's have them. And in that case, this is fine. This is fine. So they all have now. Oh! My daughter, right? She lost someone there again. Let's see. Kind of like they lose their husbands quite often. A new alliance might be nice. But Chateau Thierry. Thierry. Uh, that's not something. They're all pretty weak there. This one might be something. But he's old. Let's still go with him for now. Let's still go with him for now. We get a new alliance there. The more the better. And Oh, we have a council invitation from our king. I've come to the inexorable conclusion that you truly are the best candidate I have for my open council position. Though it pains me to do so, I'm unfortunately obliged to offer the position to a steward of East... Oh, we might be the position of a steward of East Francia. Yes, let's do this. I have no idea what this means. I've basically never done this before. We'll see what happens when we are steward of East Francia. Do we have some new actions then, most likely? No. It's just probably that he really likes us because of some reasons. And, oh, he's really weak at the moment. Yeah, he's losing his council there. She is still fighting and she's fighting fiercely. She's strong. Why is she so strong? She's got a new ally? No. But she's losing a lot of money right now. We're at 62%. My ally is fighting hard for me right now. I hope it is successful. The problem is we are at war against West Frontier at the moment. And that means that... Oh, it's not West Francia anymore. It's Francia from now on, right? So this is becoming France. There we, France. There we got the Empire now. He's an emperor. Louis the Stammerer of Francia. Can we abduct him? Oh, we could ad abduct him. There's a high chance for it, but I don't know if that is such a wise idea. Holy moly, he's powerful, truly. All right. We're still at war with her, but I have a bad feeling here right now. There are too many things happening. 
at the moment. We are also under siege once again. We have a nice income now. That's something. Um, Clement seemed to enjoy our latest feast immensely. Got along quite well with everyone he spoke. He keeps the trade gregarious. Diplomacy very good. Yeah. I don't see a problem with that. 76%. What else is happening right now? Lots of things are happening right now. County of Price, go military presence increased. That is up here, which is ours. We can unlock a new skill once again. And... Hmm. I don't like the intrigue skill that much. There's not that much anymore we can do. Seduction. Dark insights. Let's go with dark insights. Gives us a bit more... Well, I'm not torturing anyone. Do we have someone in prison? I think so. Yeah, we would have someone here. Call. We could ransom him, but only for a weak hook. We could... Huh. Torture him. But that costs us piety, and I need the piety. Right, so he's not that good with intrigue anymore. His son will be better, hopefully. No, he's a learner. And his children... At least we got children with him as well. No idea. My leech lost the war with Emperor Louis. Or oh, Louis. And we are now part of France. <laughs> yeah. My king died or my king lost the war. And we are now direct vassal of the Emperor Louis the Stammer of, Fran of Francia. Of France. That is. So he is now our leech. That is pretty cool because this, as we can see, opens up a lot of possibilities for conquest in the future. Still, we have the problem with Bavaria, which is independent right now. But that is a good that is a really good thing that's happening there right now. A donation good faith. My bishop Alaramo has received a significant donation of gold from the estate of a wealthy but childless landholder now deceased. He claims the departed lived a very frugal and pious life and wished for the gold to go where it could do good. Bishop Alaramo insists that I receive part of the donation, as I'm a paragon of Catholicism in Corezia. Or, we use that for 250 piety, with that we could change it for 100 gold. Yes. Give it to the poor. This gives us so much piety that we can now get um, money from the Pope. Which is way more important. First we need to win the war. We are at 76 and now at 100. Now we can enforce the demands. And boom, to the heartless Ermanul for may your years be short and miserable. She is now what? She's still a, a vassal here. She's still someone, but very weak. And thus we got it. Very good. Both of it is part of the duchy of Alsace. And Alsace, we have Breisgau and Sundgau now. And Kolmar and Strasbourg are still missing. Yeah, which is her once again. So she would be once again my next target there right away. And I know you are a dedicated servant of the Lord. I therefore hope you will look in sympathy on the fact that our duty to the way is down our ability to God's work, to do God's work. Perhaps some of our heavy obligations may be waived. Um, Alright. What is this? My marshal and vassal. He wants less taxes to in order to be able to do the God's work. And focus your manpower elsewhere. 250 piety we get. A levy size minus 10%. But we get lots of piety. And my gold is God's gold. No, let's go with 250 piety. Sounds better for me. Um, we can also ask once again for a bit of gold there. We're doing this. The Pope has the money. Pope Honorius, he is right now. Mm, abduction is not an idea with him. Oh, this is pretty cool. Look at that, how big Frankia is at the moment. This guy here, he is powerful. And his heir is looking like this. Can you imagine? This is the heir, Prince Louis. Alright. I guess we're also not part of the council anymore that we've lost now. But in that case, not so difficult. Right, we have 420 soldiers at the moment. Um, my men at arms are now regrouping again, I hope. And I hope we have no armies raised, right? Low taxes. Unraised men at arms. Nope. Everything should be fine here. Alright, they can marry. Oh no! My daughter? She's free? 
We didn't pay for her and she's free again. She's my daughter. She's at my court. I can marry her to someone again with a good alliance power. And we should do that. Unfortunately, there's really no one at the moment available. So I'm going to keep my daughter as is. Is she good at anything? Marshall, she's good. Yeah, she looks like it. She's also a drunkard. My daughter. But I've got a good counsel. My son and heir is... My Simon is... He's nine. Diplomacy. So he's really not that good at it. But I've got no better one. Alright, so we still want to get something. Colma looks interesting. Though we have a truce with her now. And in that case... Truce with her until 907. Right, so Strasbourg would be something. Now Strasbourg, this guy here is aligned with this guy and with this guy. So very weak, in fact. We could declare war on him. He... Oh no, that would be the king himself. Strasbourg. Can we kill him? Nah. The chance is not very high. He would then lose the alliances, making our job much easier. Huh. Or can we abduct him? Getting a hook on him? No. We could fabricate a hook. Yeah. We might do that for now. Right, using our scheming power there a bit. And we are growing on like that. We now have this one here still. She absolutely doesn't like us. Probably because we tried to kill her. And nope, we are we are ill at the moment. Send for the physician now. And what? My heir is unmarried. My heir lost his wife. Fine, 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 fine. Do we have someone with genius trait? This would be a very good opportunity right now. Genius, come on, give it to me. There is one. She's genius, she's 21, she's in the perfect age for it. She's Basque and Catholic genius. Sounds good to me. Oh, and we are the lunatic though. But in that case, <laughs> we are lunatic. Um, this is also congenital. Yeah. I don't know if you should get any more children, but having the genius trait is something. His children don't have it though, as far as I can see. No, both of them don't have it. That's at least something. And... Oh, we do need a court physician. I don't have one at the moment. Um, do more what is necessary and excellent work. What, what did she do? Um, ailments to an unsounded diet. To revitalize my body, she insists that I consume only raw vegetables and herbal teas for a week. So as not to tempt me, she confisc confiscated my stash of treats. She never returned them. The dietary restrictions turned out to be just what I needed. Um, my bishop likes me though. He's very bad. Right, another marriage that we've done. This is looking fine so far. We could get another piety money from the Pope if we wanted to. And, oh no, the solar is just barely illuminated and Berger and I are pressed close. Our lips are all but meeting. The night air is cool, but she feels molten to the touch and her breath comes in short, ragged gasps. Um, at just about the worst possible moment, my spy master, Mayor Brun... Brunild strides into the room already at full bluster. Great Duke, we must discuss my uh, calm. Oh, I didn't see you had a company. Um, we were just leaving for somewhere more private. Uh, or we gain the trade quick thinker. Diplomacy and intrigue. Yes, let's do this. A bit more intrigue. 19 intrigue. This will boost our abduction schemes even more. At least that is my hope. A uh, bit. It's not. It's not easy. All right. So far, so good. We got something else, and we are now part of Frankier itself. So there is no more West and East Frankier, but it's now combined in the Empire of Frankier, which is pretty cool. We are part of it. We are yeah, not that small anymore within it, and it's time for a bit more diplomacy, I should think. Then, stay tuned.